Hey, you're kind of quiet in here. Yeah, I figured I'd get a head start on some paperwork. You still playing with that doll, I see. As always, hope. Even you taught me that. Good morning, Rachel Ray. <laughs> <sighs> how do you think we did this period? You know how it goes. We could have top sales revenue twice, and Little Miss Diva still wouldn't be satisfied. Keep your hopes up, Gabe. Maybe we'll get lucky this time. No, if we're really lucky, Madonna would be menstruating. <laughs> love to say that back, but that would be a lie. It's not a good morning. And do you want to know why, Rachel? Still didn't go. Oh, quite the talkative bunch this morning. Too bad that didn't show up in your reports this period. What do you mean, Patterson? I thought we reached out our goals. No, Gabriel. No. Then once again, the dynamic duo didn't reach their goal. Patterson, I don't understand. We worked really hard this period. Not hard enough. Well, I'm sorry. Don't I... say I'm sorry. Don't. Because I, sweetheart, I already know that. Patterson, I think we get the point. Let me be brief. I, I have a meeting. And you two, maybe you can make yourselves useful. I don't know. Maybe do something! That man never ceases to amaze me. Did you get the towels? Well, thanks. What is that? I don't know. I found them in the maintenance closet. It maybe it belongs to Mrs. Nucy, the housekeeper. She's the only one who really ever goes in there. Kind of looks. Looks like a. like a voodoo doll. A voodoo doll? Like in the movies? Cool. How does it work? I don't know, but I bet Google does. Okay, so it says in order for the voodoo doll to work, we have to get a hair sample or a picture of the subject. And whatever we do to the voodoo doll will be done to the subject. Maybe we should try it on Patterson. Give him a taste of his own medicine. Okay, Brielle, don't waste your time on that stuff. Any hope for revenge on Patterson is worth a shot. Here, I copy the picture. You know what, Patterson? Having these meetings about you and your team's failure is really getting old. 
You're an embarrassment. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Anyway, your revenue is down again. The average reports are downright pitiful. I mean, maybe you're the problem. Oh, I am sorry. Nelson, I don't know what come over my leg. Get it together, Patterson. As I was saying, if you don't fix this, I'll replace you. Get out of my office. Huh. No, no, Gabe. You have to live a little. <gasps> Nelson, I, I just really wanted again to tell you how sorry. Really what? I'm sorry, I just got a little hot. I just really want to tell you how sorry I am. Ooh, is the heat on? I'm really, really hot! Ooh, Lord! Ooh, Lord! Ooh! That ought to keep the Grinch hot for a while. <laughs>